South Korea's COVID-19 control strategy is characterized by its swift and broad test-trace-treat approach. It starts with an extensive, technology-based contact tracing that identifies the recent movements of confirmed patients. The data is anonymized, limited in duration and scope, and carefully disclosed to the public which others can use to determine whether they may have come in contact with any confirmed case. Those at risk of infection are tested, quarantined if necessary, and get treated. However, did it come at a potential cost to civil liberties? Let's first take a look at the contact tracing system in Korea. When a patient tests positive for the coronavirus, epidemiological survey is the first step in tracing the origin of the infection. Its goal is to quickly identify and locate other potentially infected persons to curb the further spread of the virus. The Korean government strictly controls access to the COVID-19 data platform, which is used to track and analyze all confirmed cases. All stored personal data will be deleted once the outbreak is over. After the 2015 MERS outbreak, the collection of personal data was initially authorized in case of a public health emergency. The amended infectious disease control laws limit the scope of collection, usage, and dissemination of personal data to the public. However, amid the outbreak of the COVID-19, the National Human Rights Commission of Korea expressed its concerns about excessive disclosure of personal data by some local governments, several of which information could potentially be pieced together to identify a person. The Commission called for the authorities to implement measures to ease the public's concerns and protect patients' privacy. In response, the Korea Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, KCDC, quickly published detailed guidelines with timeframes and the scope of publicly accessible information to protect patients' privacy. These guidelines were adopted by all levels of the government and apply to surveys or disclosures of any necessary information. Korea has endeavored to strike a balance between public health concerns and personal data protection. Without strict lockdowns, Korea's such efforts have allowed the nation to maintain its transparency, openness, and democratic values in fighting against COVID-19.